Hey Shopify enthusiastics, it's Steven back with another game changing tutorial. Today let's dive into the world of the typography. Even wondered how to add custom fonts to the Shopify store and give up a unique touch? Well, you are in the right place. Stick around as I got you through the changing fonts in Shopify. So first of all, why customizing fonts? Before we jumped into the how, we wanted to talk about the why. Customizing fonts can transform the look and the feel of your Shopify store, making it stand out and resonate with your branding. Trust me. It's all about creating a memorable experience for your customers. So get ready to elevate your store visuals identity because you wanted to choose the right fonts. Now, in order to choose the right fonts that align with your brand, I will show some tips to select fonts that can complement your store personality on into the message. If you open any tab, I'm going to go for Google Fonts. This is an actual section, an actual website created by Google that can be helping you to download fonts totally for free. So you can filter them uh, here by the kind of the language, the kind of technology, the creative stuff, the classification, and there's a lot of properties you wanted to focus on. So let's say, for example, that I want to look out for some colored, and it's going to be showing you lots of ones that you can use, and of course, you can download it, and that family is totally for free. So once you find the actual font that resonates with your branding, what I can totally suggest to you, uh, first of all, is to focus into what you're actually trying to look for. For example, let's say that I look out for some variable colors, uh, variable funding stuff. Uh, I need it to be, let's say, like a display, like some handwriting, uh, monospace, not even text at all. So choose the one that best suits for your actual branding, then move on into the next step, which is adding the custom fonts to your Shopify. Now this is the exciting part. I'll guide you through the step-by-step -step process of adding custom fonts to your Shopify store. Now it's easier than you think and the input is actually huge. So let's go back here into Shopify. I'm gonna leave you guys a link down below in the description so if you want to get started totally for free, just click down below. And then later on, you're gonna be inside your actual store. So now that we are here into our actual Shopify, what you want to do is to focus, of course, into the little part says online store. Directly in here into online store, let's focus into the section that says customize inside the current theme we are actually using. Let's go here into customize. Directly here into customize, you see that we have the actual store, we can start to customize it. Now let's go directly into the web pod, we can go for the theme settings. Directly here into the theme settings, we wanted to focus into the typography. Now as you can see here, we have a specific typography for the headlines, for the body, and that will be actually it. So if you wanted to change the specific font, what you want to do is to choose the change section here. So as you can see, there are a lot of fonts that you can choose. They are totally for free. Now, uh, if you are, let's say, for example, downloaded into Pixar's computer, my code is low at times, uh, something that can be helping you is to browse the fonts that are directly from the Google fonts and upload it here into Shopify. Usually what everybody does is just to try it out and try to find the actual title of this designer into the actual Shopify. So what I do is to copy the title and paste it here into Shopify. We might be wanted to use an application. If you go and open any tab, let's go for app.shopify.com. Here, it should be showing us a lot of applications that we can use totally for free. Sometimes other uh, uh, paid versions. But here, what I want to do is to go for custom fonts. For the uh, T. Now, this is the font picker that are directly added from Google Fonts that can be helping you to add Google Fonts to your theme without coding. So, this is going to be helping for people who don't know absolutely anything about coding. And to be honest, it's much more easier and much faster to use. So, I'm going to hit now into install the application. Once you hit into install, you have now permission to build the data and view and edit the stored data. So, now that we are inside this actual application of the RT, what you just want to do is to import the Google Fonts that we liked it before, which in this case is going to be added. Uh, here it's going to for customize the app. I uh, add new Google font. Really important to enable all the elements you wanted to see into your store. In this case, I put all of them just to make sure, just to make like a quick uh, example, of course. So as you can see now, my store, it's looking great. Now for me, I think that I'm going to go back into what it was before, but this is how we can edit custom fonts directly 
uh, into Shopify and the best part we don't need to pay absolutely for anything because that's the important part of this. You don't need to pay anything for that. So guys, congratulations because we have changed, uh, check the changes guys and of course uh, it actually looks really great. So if you find this true helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, share it with your fellow merchants, subscribe for more Shopify tips. Remember you have the link down below in the description to get started inside the actual Shopify. Thank you so much for watching the video guys. Thanks for joining me for this fun customization journey guys. Until next time, happy customizing.